What's up, bro? It's your girl, Juan Wing, here at Maya's Treasure Box. This is for my Virgos. You know, I listen, y'all know I always sit with my fire signs because my fire signs be rocking with me. They fucking with me. They liking, they sharing, they talking to me. But listen, I'm going to do this for my Virgos because I love y'all. I got a Virgo ascendant, y'all. Like, shit, y'all, I'm still living like last night. Y'all, don't y'all judge me and stuff. Let me put my, look, y'all, that's my lighter. That's not my nipple because y'all know how y'all know how the goddamn screen committee could be. <laughs> Y'all, look, my eyelashes, y'all leave me alone. Anyways, my Virgos, bring that ass on up here. Let's talk. Oh, y'all, I really look like I'm on this. I, I look, I really look like I'm on. Oh, shit, y'all. <laughs> I love everybody. My Virgos, y'all got somebody that y'all was dealing with. Y'all could have even been married to this person, right? And it's like this right here. You're going back and forth with people or against people about this particular relationship, fighting with people, arguing all that shit. Silent secret competition that you don't even know you fucking a part of. That motherfucker broke your goddamn heart. And then they come back with a half ass apology. Now this is where this is where it flip over at. Cause that's what you wanted them back. Now you can have them back. And you like, I don't even know what the fuck was wrong with me. Like, what the fuck was I thinking? I don't blame you, my queens or my kings. Y'all don't fix y'all motherfucking crown, okay? So y'all ain't even stuck in this person really at this moment to be honest. And you realizing that it's like it's like you had that epiphany. Everything happened for a reason. Damn, God, now I know why you do so. Lord, just let me know ahead of time. He said, well, bitch, did you say remove everybody away from you? That don't mean you no good. You like, well, damn, Jesus, like, you should have fucking told me. Like, damn, I would have been more prepared. I'm telling you, he get me like that all the time. Even when he might push me down the stairs sometimes. Y'all don't pay me no attention. I'm full of shit. I like to make jokes and everything else, but this shit be real. It's authentic and it's genuine as fuck. It's, I'm not for real though. Shit. I ain't scared to be myself. That's it. Love me and hate me. I'm a name. Put some respect. Listen, y'all. Y'all feel like this motherfucker was cheating on y'all any goddamn ways. But you really ready for this celebration. I don't know if y'all got somebody else in mind, in line. Y'all trying to balance this shit. You're really not sleeping at night because you're not, you don't want the motherfucker that's trying to come back around that y'all had this butt. You don't want them. And you can't even figure it out. Like, you don't want them shit. You don't want the ass. You don't want the ass. It's for you. What you got to figure out is are you going to follow your heart? Or are you going to go by, you know, Virgos, y'all, the perfectionists? Or are you going to go by what looks right? This is your challenge. So let's see. We're going to break this down. I got my real nigga salute card, too. Don't y'all judge my freaking card. Just like I said, don't judge my eyelashes. all good. Because y'all know I'm going to fix it. I'm going to go get me some more lashes and shit. Whoever, listen, whoever the fuck bought all the goddamn medium fucking lashes in Bronzeville, Georgia. I hope y'all fucking choke or some shit. Because that don't make no goddamn sense. Y'all bought up all the fucking lashes and shit. That shit ain't fucking right. I don't know how to put on scripts, okay? I got to cut them bitches up because my mind is not that. I know how to do the little tiny script. I don't know how to do the whole goddamn thing. My mind don't function. <laughs> well, at least I know I'm fucked up. It's a lot of y'all fucked up, too. Y'all have no goddamn clue. I know I got issues. It's all good, though. I love everybody. I like God made me this way, so apparently he a little fucked up, too. Shit, he got a sense of humor. You got to laugh sometimes. Y'all waiting on somebody or something. What y'all waiting on? What are you waiting on? Could y'all be dealing with an Aries? Y'all wait, y'all. Some y'all couldn't. Y'all been waiting. Y'all was waiting on somebody y'all was with. Y'all took this leap of faith. Y'all, y'all was like, okay, y'all want this person back. You got this person back. Like I said, some y'all could be married to this person. You got them back. Maybe somebody else that's younger came around, or maybe that's just them. They just took their time by coming back, and you feel like they just left you. They ghosted you anyways, and so it's like, oh yes. See, it's like you moving towards your goal, what you want. That motherfucker left you out in the cold. The only thing he did, that was a blessing in disguise. Your biggest struggle is really blessings in disguise. This person who you could have been married with could have been a Sagittarius. Or somebody from your past that's trying to come back and reconcile. You got Leo or Aries also now. Let's see. You got somebody that always got something to fucking say. Somebody always got something to say. See, that's the line, motherfucker, because maybe this is how it started. Because it's like, you know they was cheating. They was not right. And it's like, they didn't want to give you this half-ass cup of love and speak. Uh-uh, hell no. Nah, nobody got time for that shit. And they always come with the bullshit. Hurt your feelings. Hurt your feelings. Got you sitting up. You can't even fucking sleep at night. But the truth is what it is. And it's like, only thing it is, like, you was waiting. What you wanted this family to be. You was waiting on that shit, and you know you had to make a motherfucking choice. And what you chose? Cut that motherfucker. I, I ain't blame at y'all. That's what y'all supposed to do.
supposed to do? You don't let nobody handle you like that shit. You got to know your own worth. If hell, how you expect somebody else to know your worth if you don't know your own worth? So here go my motherfucking real nigga salute card. Don't y'all laugh at my cards. Y'all just wait till I get them in the deck. Well, let me see if I can shuffle these. Oh, shit, y'all. They did it a little bit. So let's see my real nigga salute for my Tauruses. Because I love my I'm not my Tauruses. My Virgos. I just did Tauruses. Sorry. Okay, my Virgos. Listen, you are only what you answer to. You wife material or husband material. I just said that, my No regrets. And it ain't funny to the like to the to the rabbit got the gun. But first of all, I'ma need y'all to turn the lights on. And what this basically means is you know you're a queen. You know your standards, where you stand at, what you will and will not accept. You got to feel that shit, too. When you look in the mirror, you probably look in the mirror and see every fucking scar that ever happened to you. Other people look at you and don't know what the fuck you see. Because I bet you beautiful as hell on the inside. It's not funny to the rabbit got the gun. So everything, let me tell you, anybody that did something wrong to you and that shit was not right. And I ain't talking about by law. I'm talking about by God. That shit was just not right. You going to get your day. You gonna get your day, and, and listen, trust and believe they already at your foot, so you know why they ain't feeling the rapture yet because you haven't let them go. When you let it go, that's when they feel the rapture. Come on now, my Virgos, y'all better than that, my Virgos. Y'all smart as fuck. I'm trying to tell you, but you, people are blinded to the things that they want and love. I bet some of y'all Virgo men probably got some damn wipes by the damn toilet stool to wipe y'all ass when y'all shit. Boy, one thing about it, y'all some clean motherfuckers though. <laughs>